So these are uh, six volt uh, golf cart uh, batteries. Um, 230 ampere hour, I think. They're uh, quite old now. They came out of uh, the original cub van conversion. And uh, there's 96 volts worth of batteries there. And it's all powering this. And what we have here is a Volkswagen Jetta O2J 5-speed uh, transmission, cable shift, hydraulic clutch. We have an adapter plate, this red section here, which adapts the uh, HP EVS 50 horse continuous AC electric motor to the uh, transmission. It's uh, 50 horsepower continuous, 75 horsepower peak, 115 foot pounds of torque uh, maximum capability. It's an AC drive motor. So what we have here is a Curtis uh, controller, 1238. It's a 96 volt AC converter. Basically takes DC volts coming in, converts it to a three phase AC voltage out to drive the motor. So you have a main contactor here, which uh, switches the power on and off to the controller. And the controller controls the uh, power to the uh, electric motor. We've got uh, various controls for turning it on and off temporarily. This is a test bench situation, if that wasn't obvious. <laughs> and we've got uh, th a throttle pot here, which controls the speed. We have a small display here, which uh, presently tells us the uh, motor RPM. So yeah, so we'll energize this system as if we were turning on the uh, ignition. And um, that will engage that solenoid. So that's now engaged. Power going to the controller. Status light blinking. Everything's okay. So normally on a throttle, you have an uh, interlock uh, switch, which uh, when you put your foot on, the interlock switches on. And then as the, you depress the uh, foot pedal, the, um, the uh, throttle will increase. This is, it has electronic reverse. So this is in forward presently. That would be off, nothing. And then uh, reverse is up. So we'll throw that into reverse. We've engaged the throttle. And we're going to accelerate. Back to off. Throw it into reverse. And we'll go the other way. Probably all noticed that winds up pretty good. You can see we got the uh, tachometer here. Try and get a good shot of that. You'll be able to see what the engine RPM is as it cranks up. Actually, before I do that, I'm going to put it in re in forward. Not sure how the transmission would be totally happy going backwards at 5,000 RPM. <laughs> Yeah, so all in all, um, that's all now bench tested, essentially. It's functioning, um, ready to uh, be uh, installed in the car. So that'll be the next step, is to uh, pick this puppy up and uh, put it into the uh, vehicle. So I'm quite happy with this so far. I'll turn that off, take it out of gear, so to speak. And shut the system down and the relay drops yeah, out. So this is Cub Van uh, EV2.
project. Definitely a step up from the original curb watt.